But these are like the middle dungeons, and there's only five levels of uh, Cataclysm content. Um, so I was, I guess maybe that's why I was kind of disappointed. Like there just didn't seem like there was that much content to, uh, um, you know, I don't know. I mean, like I said, I, I skipped out on all of Cataclysm, and I'm not overly excited to kind of explore it that much either so uh, I'll escort the children of Tortola out of here and seal up the accursed portal I'll leave you to inform Tortola of our victory simply step back to the flame gate okay. all right we're making progress Uh, and where is Tortola? Oh gosh, why is he all the way back there? Uh, excellent. So I've done, uh, today I've done a few episodes of, uh, uh, my Orc Shaman. Um, I already got her all the way to level 42. I've used up all of her rested bonus just by running instances, um, and those went really, really well. I got into a, a really good group, and we queued up for several. Uh, so that should be interesting watching when that goes up. Um, you've been to the Firelands. Nemesis is dead, so it is finished. Thank you. Nemesis destroyed. I feel rejuvenated, powerful, awakened. Tell Sarah my strength is hers. The Twilight's Hammer will fall. So we got to fly all the way back. Oh, goodness. So you would think that uh, just hopping here and then flying would be fast, but it doesn't because it, uh, like, meanders. So. so there's, like, proving ground things that you can do. Uh, so I'm interested to start doing those. Because um, I have absolutely no idea how to do any of that stuff. And that's going to be fun learning. Uh, and I hope, I hope you guys enjoy that. And that's, again, that's part of the why that I want to not... I don't want to do it on one of my other characters. Like, I have not touched it even on my uh, high-level people. Like, my level 90s. I've not touched it. Uh, because I want to do it with you guys. I want us to kind of explore that content together and, uh, you know, that, that should be really fun. Uh, by relieving Tortola of his final burdens, you have acquired for us a formidable ally. And the final piece of the puzzle, steal yourself, Goblin. The most difficult part of our journey is to begin. We will begin the fight to our. To, we will begin the fight to their stronghold. Only once there has been a leader c capable of commanding demigods and mortals alike. His name was Jared's Shadow Song, and his ability to lead in battle was such that Cenarius and the other ancients placed themselves under his command. He disappeared for years, and his whereabouts were unknown until now. He is being held captive inside a twilight camp in Dark Whisper Gorge. Your job is to infiltrate the ranks and free Jared. Uh, speak to the one known as Ortel in Dark Whisper Pass to the southeast. Ooh. Yeah, just, uh, just basically mounting up and flying straight there is usually your best option, uh, especially once you have like the fly, fastest fly mounts. Um, ooh. I love having like long draw distance and able to actually use it. It's cool. <clears throat> uh, so usually the only time I actually take a flight path is when I'm not recording and I want to go get something to drink. Fly, Raven, fly!
Yeah, I think this was actually like another tunnel that you went through. Yeah. They're watching us. Hmm. Interesting. Uh, hey there. I'm glad you see... To see they sent someone of your caliber for this operation. This here is going to call for some subtlety. We can't risk Commander Shadow Song getting killed. Uh, you're here at last, Goblin, just in time as well. News of Ragnaros's emergence has spurred a large wave of recruits to seek membership to the Twilight's Hammer. If you're to infiltrate the cult, the time is now. We'll need recruitment papers signed in blood by a referring Twilight member. Lure one of the new recruits away from the group and hit them with this blackjack. If you're lucky, you'll be able to steal his recruiting papers. Oh, there we go. I was like, I didn't think they were that far away. That doesn't sound creepy at all. Uh oh, he's got a goatee. Ah, oh, this doesn't bode well. Excellent. I'll do my best to alter these documents. There. Not my best work, but certainly not my worst. You'll be known as Govalandimus among the recultists. These papers will bump you ahead of the other recruits and allow you to speak directly to the Twilight instructors. Go to the proving grounds and show these condemn. Show these to Condena the Pitiless. She's separating the wheat from the chaff. Show her what you're made of. I mean, flying in on a big dragon, I mean, that should automatically give me uh, um, bonus points, I think. Uh, we will, uh, you will address me with the respect I am due, recruit. Uh, Gavalandimus, let us hope your parents brought you into this world with more than just a ridiculous name. The Twilight's Hammer is a major power to be reckoned with. Thanks to us, Deathwing is free. Thanks to us, old gods have risen from the bowels of the earth. Thanks to us, high jaw burns. What do you think you have to offer us? I'd love to say that with with the tides turning against us in Hijal, every recruit helps our cause and so on. But to be perfectly blunt, most of you had nothing but a burden. If I had a copper for every peasant who got too scared when the cataclysm hit and now wishes to join our side, well, let's just say I'd be a rich woman. Fortunately, we have checks in place to separate the wheat from the chaff. Go and prove yourself to the fiery instructors below. Hopefully you'll do better than the others. Uh, it is customary for new recruits to be sent on difficult or sometimes impossible tasks. I was sent to obtain a black dragon scale. Last year's instructors demanded a feather from a phoenix. Your lot has it relatively easy. Find me a handful of flame blossoms. They grow around here in relative abundance. Alright, there will be a gigantic corehound roaming the fields to keep things interesting. Do your best to avoid him. Okay. Uh, look at these fools. Half of them won't even make it past this trial. They're not worthy of ascending into our inner circles, but perhaps, perhaps they're worthy of menial service. Take this gem and utilize its power to save some of the less competent supplicants. Those who have no chance of succeeding. Those already on fire, preferably. Hemolated supplicants. That's... Oh, goodness. Wow, absolutely squat in the queue. Lovely. I've been given another chance to serve. I will not fail again.
Oh. Let's see if we get in. Usually the wait is so long, people actually end up forgetting. Oh yeah, here we go. <clears throat> I don't know a lot about this place, uh, so I'm not even going to attempt to explain what's going on. Turn pet growl off. Turn. Set focus on wherever he is. Deathwing's fall. So these are like interconnected islands in the sky. Uh, I'm not really even sure where Vortex Pinnacle is. So. Let's go and pull out a pet, shall we? Um, oh, let's get our new gold jouster out. Or we could do our clockwork now. Yeah. And he's going to rush straight in there and get absolutely mobbed. Maybe not. Now that is kind of a, a difficult pull. It's uh, probably should have waited for that patrol to go by, but oh well. I think there's two of them up here. No. Now, I know this, uh, the last boss has caused, uh, many people to absolutely, uh, flip out, but I didn't think he was that bad. Um, Mountain tank. Oh, 
Oh, that bombard. I still love it. <clears throat> uh, some of the fights in here are actually quite difficult, so... See, I don't... Um, uh, well, that's not too bad. I don't think you can actually kill these. I'm definitely uh, in the need for a new gun or a weapon of some type. Yeah, the best thing to do is just uh, skip those little guys. Oh, my tank, the tank died. Whoop. 